Hi, I'm Cassie with LexisNexis, and I'm here to tell you today about our Ravelview feature. Ravelview can help you find your key cases faster and uncover some commonly overlooked cases in your research. To access Ravelview, go up to the Ravelview icon up at the top. And the first thing you'll notice is over on the left-hand side, we have a ton of different bubbles. Each one of these bubbles represents one case in the first 75 cases in your results list. The larger the bubble, the more that case has been cited. Our graph is divided up into a number of different swim lanes. These swim lanes all each indicate one of the different levels of court. And down at the bottom, you'll see a timeline. If we look in each swim lane, you can see that some cases are higher than others. The cases higher up in your swim lane are cases that are more relevant to the search that you ran. If we click on one of our bubbles, over on the right, you can see the case that it represents. So this large bubble from the Supreme Court represents basic versus Levinson. All of the lines that come off of that bubble are other cases in your results list that cite back to basic versus Levinson. And the color of the line indicates the shepherd's treatment for that case. If we look at one of the bubbles that's connected to our case, we can see that our case was distinguished in camera versus bloom. And below that, you can see the exact part of the case where our selected case was cited. So Ravelview helps you not only find the most seminal cases on your, on your results list, but also helps you see how your cases interact with one another. I hope looking at Ravelview can help you find some of those must-read cases that may otherwise be hidden on your results list.